Vsauce! I'm Jake and I'm here in a hotel at San Diego Comic-Con for the screening of The Maze Runner. Hey, Jake. Hi, Jake. Oh, hi, Wes and James, the director and the author of The Maze Runner. How weird that you guys came odd. into this I know. I found oh, my way in. It's, yeah, it's, so it's really in the hotel room. Yeah. This is very uh, weird. Yeah, but actually, cool. I'm glad you're here because I have a question. Okay. How did you design the maze? Did you really just ask me that? Yeah. Dude, it's a small world, man. I actually used the world's biggest Pac-Man from Dong number eight. Oh. Amazing! I can't believe Vsauce was an inspiration. That is literally unbelievable. <laughs> Dot org. But how would you like something astronomically large? Is it a dong? James, it is a dong. Something that you can do online now, guys. This panorama of the moon is made up of 681 billion pixels, making it the largest photo in existence. Sorry, largest photo ever dong episode, ye have been dethroned. For four years, the Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter took 10,581 photos to completely capture the northern pole of the moon, allowing you to zoom in and explore every nook, cranny, and crater on the surface. After exploring the surface of the moon, explore nearby asteroids available for mining, and how much they would be worth. It turns out, a lot. But now let's turn our attention to our home planet and see what it looks like from space. You look great in this photo, by the way. And you're just my type. Face. The Universal Typeface is a project that collects handwriting from people all over the world. You can contribute your own and then filter by age, gender, right or left-handedness, or by country to see how you compare. Then travel around the world with smarty pins. Smarty Pins is a trivia game that tests your geographical knowledge. It is also kind of cool when you get the wrong answer because it shows literally how far off you were. When taking the correct route to the destination, watch out for traffic. Simulator. Change the parameters to see how traffic jams form and how certain variables impact the flow. While stuck in traffic, listen to some tunes with music. Adjust the genre sliders to find the best song for your current mood. Yes, more Moomba tone. Or make your own beautiful, soothing, relaxing, and romantic songs with the Screaming Goat Piano. I don't know about you, but I am sick of sitting in traffic, so let's travel by drone. A website that catalogs and places by location footage captured by drones all around the planet, allowing you to fly through and see parts of the world you normally wouldn't. Luckily, the in-flight entertainment is classic 90s and early 2000s Nickelodeon. Nick Reboot plays non-stop Nick and even has it scheduled like a TV channel, and it is fantastic. I love you. Once landing at your destination, get out and explore Adam Savage's workshop using Google Maps. It is filled with ridiculously awesome movie memorabilia. If you want your own movie merchandise, there's Film Garb, which finds where you can buy the clothes worn by characters in movies and TV shows. Come to me, Walter White's hat. Instead of garb, get a GURP. GURP is a rock climbing game that tests your coordination and your patience. You have to press the corresponding keys on your keyboard while using shift to flex them muscles, and it is frustrating. Not surprisingly, it is made by the same people who made Quop. Do you remember Quop? I remember. A beautiful site that acts as a metaphor for Alzheimer's. It is a landscape of memories to explore, and you can leave your own, but the fewer memories left, the faster the site disappears. And hey, okay.com is there if you need a little pick-me-up. Now let's get creative and use our imagination. A cool tool where you drag color-changing lines around to create different patterns and designs. It almost looks like a music visualizer, which is perfect for this epic sequencer. Online Sequencer is a pretty fleshed out music creation tool where you can share your final mixes with friends, upload MIDI files, and create awesome jams like this. While listening to your latest masterpiece, travel through a warp field on your way to Shiritori. Play against the computer or real opponents in a race to find out who can string words together faster and better. If you do run out of words, find ones using the Internet Anagram Server, where words are rearranged to create different existing ones. For example, type in tacos and out comes Ascot. For some advanced anagramming, do a phrase like Jake smells like kittens and get Lake smelliest jets kink. 
After rearranging words, rearrange the Simpsons colors with the Simpsons in CSS. I'm going to change Flanders' color to Chrome. Chrome is like snake, but with only one button. Use the spacebar to go around the circle, avoiding your tail and catching white dots that explode to make paths for you to navigate through. And if you have a lot of time, well, then try Sisyphean fun time. Just like poor King Sisyphus who had to endlessly roll a boulder up a hill, you move one grain of sand out of 8,610 from one side to another forever. And you know what goes amazing with some dongs? Please stop. Nope. Some just awesome music? Exactly, some just awesome music, a new jam over on We Saw So. You can listen to some jams while you check out some dongs. That's good. And we should probably go check out Major and our starting soon, so. Yeah. That is true. I'm very excited to see it. And, as, as always, always, thanks for watching. <laughs>